Just as we humans need to protect ourselves from the cold weather by wearing warm clothing, from the hot sun by applying sunscreen, or from disease through the use of vaccines, crops also need protection from disease, insects, and weeds. Every year, a significant amount of food crops are lost due to pests. When pest infestations reach a certain level, farmers often use pesticides to protect their crops and to ensure a good harvest. There are three main types of pesticides used to protect crops. Herbicides eliminate weeds that are harmful to crops because they compete with the crop plants for rain, sunlight, nutrients, and space. Fungicides control plant diseases that can damage or even completely destroy crops. At times, plant diseases also cause the grain to be unsafe to eat. Insecticides control insect infestations that eat away at crops. Insects can cause abnormal growth or even destroy the crops completely. Pesticides are well tested prior to their sale to the public. In fact, there is a Government of Canada agency dedicated solely to managing the approval and registration of all pesticides used in the country. Using pesticides is an important crop production tool for many farmers, and their responsible use is vital to ensuring the sustainability of their land and the economy. Precision is the key. Farmers, with the help of agronomists, closely monitor their fields to assess the risk of pest infestations and determine if or when a pesticide should be used. Application guidelines help farmers determine the correct stage of the crop, appropriate weather conditions, and the amount of water the pesticide must be diluted in. The precision equipment farmers use to apply pesticides is guided by GPS and helps to reduce any overlap and leave the appropriate amount of space between sensitive areas such as water and trees. Each pesticide manufacturer recommends rates for application, similar to medicine for humans. It is important the correct dose is given. Too little won't achieve any results and too much can be harmful. The concept of IPM, or Integrated Pest Management, is considered a best practice for farmers in making decisions on how to prevent, and then control, harmful infestations of weeds, insects, or disease. IPM includes rotating crops from year to year, selecting insect and disease-resistant varieties, adjusting the seed rate and timing of planting, and maintaining wetlands and riparian areas for biodiversity and ecological balance. Farmers are stewards of their environment their crops, soil, livestock, and the health of their communities depend on proper pesticide management.